Hello from Slovenia again. I have just a little bit of paints left from my uh, previous pour. Uh, and I will try to do just a straight pour with it because just think that I uh, let's just pour some of this Windsor Violet on the bottom and then I will add some titanium white and I have a little bit of this cadmium yellow lemon hue little picky pigments if you didn't saw my previous pour it was a split cup pour that turned out gorgeous I will show you the dry result of that one too on the end of this video this is uh, reflex orange by Amsterdam And I have Cardinal Red by Artist Colors. Bellini, these little piggy pigments. Okay, and I have a scrape of paint from the previous pour, and I will just pour some here in the middle for flow extender. And now I will pour this on top.
So I obviously <clears throat> played a lot, but I'm so happy with the result. Some cool, cool stuff here with the racks and then those lines here and I can already see how these piggies will dry wow <laughs> okay so stay tuned for the dry results so first of all I will show you the dry results of the previous one that I promised. I did got some lumps from one paint but resin will make them disappear. Dry just gorgeous I love it <clears throat> and to the painting that I did with the paints that are left and I want to use them it's this little gem I'm in love with this painting because it's just gorgeous these ribbons here and the shimmer and I love those details where I wrecked it I love it, I really do think it's a beautiful abstract piece. <laughs> so, sometimes, you know, the easy techniques, the straight pores create just not sometimes, they are creating just amazing art. So thanks for watching and see you on the next one. Bye.